Oh, guys, a minute left. Um, again, if you guys are going to be here, well, Tethros, I've done that before, but sometimes it makes the stream lag. Right now, though, it's looking pretty good. Aside from that, hit the follow, hit the sub. Thank you guys for being here. If you enjoy the stream, if you enjoy the cast, I'm going to be on all night casting wars back to back to back to back. Going to be busy all night, so don't go anywhere, man. We're going to be casting all night. We got 40 seconds until this war. Again, I'm going to be turning off the alert box here if anybody follows or anything like that during the war so it doesn't interrupt it. So, uh, just so you know, we get to see all the action. 30 seconds until we go and guys we have aggression on offense here we are in morningdale on planet pluto we have aggression on offense marauder company coming in strong going to be taken on take care they have reinforcements from o run boys o run players coming in here from o run um they are coming in here too to reinforce this aggression squad so very interested to see on how that impacts this game i want to see it go to a fort um i do i really do a little bit of lag on the stream this is why i was talking about sometimes we'll see if it keeps doing it or not one second guys let's make it happen let's go let's go guys the war has started it looks like aggression now aggression known to actually fan out around b i wonder if that's going to be the play here they're pushing into this rotate right now Push coming into the rotate. Defenders trying to answer it. Take care. Knows that they need to get some, uh, you know, they need to try and get some kills. Deuce X going down immediately for Valhalla going down as well. That actually is a Merc squad. Valhalla is yellow. So it does look like TC sodded some yellows. Just uses TC player on the side. Uses TC player. Is the shot caller. Is the main guy. And it looks like he's getting hacked and slashed. And you don't want your shot caller going down. This is not good. In the first minute, 30, or in the first 30 seconds, it looks like aggression is displaying that aggression. Trying to push into a hard tc going down but look or tc player going down but look at these big grabs over here big clumps on this side of the point and it's going in the favor of aggression you have respawns though coming out remember respawn timers are still super quick at this point in time kings is not a king anymore and that king has fallen he is going down guys we are already getting into this spicy war man first war of the night and it looks like aggression is trying to deliver we have a couple blue skulls going down here though respawns coming up you can see that those respawns came in pretty hot respawns coming in pretty hot already able to look like they're dissuading some of that they're making sure they group up a little bit on that fourth side defenders grouping up and it looks like influence on the point does go down so a though does start ticking a has about five or ten percent influence on it you can see hay spots being bought here by yak yak gonna be trying to put some hay spots in the mix trying to get a little fast trying to get to the points so you can see yak is being called to go to b and it looks like the attackers pushing on b a little bit a is taking out about 25 it looks like it might be stabilizing a little bit defenders look like they might be trying to answer over there and, it, and we have a lot of influence going over down a is still a is still actually ticking it's going on about 45 it's going on almost 50 a is ticking up pretty fast um b starts having a little bit of influence on well yak doing a good job of surviving in the mix but got to be careful he might be going down and he does a looks like it had about 45 percent influence but it looked like it might actually be going no it's still slowly ticking defenders are fighting over there but it's a bit of a back and forth that's what you can tell just by looking at that influence it's not going up fast but it's not really going down and it looks like now it is going in the favor of the attackers. A, taking at about 50, 55%. This is still good. You have to take care on the ropes a little bit on this point. B, taking decent grab here on Legonagabuff and Kings. <laughs> and A is taking at about 70%. And it looks like they're getting the call to push on the point. You can see aggression pushing on the point. Guys, a little bit of lag. A little bit of lag here. We're good, though. A is taking at 75, going on 80%. B has about 10% on it. Kyle W, the main focus here, gets taken down. A might be going in the favor of aggression. TC not going to be too worried about that. They traditionally give up a point, um, so they might not be too worried about it. But no, it looks like A actually might be stabilizing. They are not giving up anything. A is stabilizing, and actually, TC wards them off. It got to, like, 97%. It is a travesty to see it. A, that A point going in the favor of the defenders tc stops it and b though is taking it 45 going on 50 percent look at these huge clumps on the front of the point and yak going down respawns in 10 seconds Response in 10 seconds, guys. It looks like B has about 40% influence, but not going up after that. And it looks like that A play was so close, but it was not enough. It's a tragedy. It looks like A is still ticking, though. It's at about 75%, but it's slowly going down. Attackers are going to be looking to try and reinforce that so they don't lose all that influence. That's a ton of influence on a point. You'd hate to see it lose. You would hate to see it lose. 
Let's go, guys. Let's go. A is at about 50%. It looks like Take Care is warding aggression off pretty heavily here. Take Care going to be fighting over here along this uh, war camp site. Yak coming out, but he's getting put in a little ice. He's trying to get out of there, man. He got in and almost died immediately. C starts ticking. C has about 10 or 15. Going on 25% influence really fast. So you can see C ticking up fast. A it looks like it might be reinforced by somebody. So they're going aggression. Going for the three-point hold right now. They're trying to get influence on all three points. You can see this B team here from um from take care right now fighting heavy lm ken daddy sales surviving and yak is going down response coming up in five quick hydro homie check response coming up guys response coming up Let's go. C has about 50% influence and B has about 10 or 15. A has about 10% influence as well. There's a whole lot of influence on points. Let's see if it can translate into a point take. That's the thing. Take care. Actually not giving up any side points in this war. They want to make sure they have all the points. B going in the favor of the attackers right now has about 25 going on 30%. And you can see Yak charging in here. A couple respawns charging in as well from take care. They got to be careful though. It looks like aggression has agency on this point. A and C going down in the favor of the defenders. So now the players at B got to be careful because you can imagine that defenders have become reinforced as B play. B taking at about 40-45%, but watch the sides, guys. Take care is going to be coming in from the sides, and that's exactly what I was talking about. They come in from the sides and clear up some of the attackers, and it looks like aggression's actually struggling um, on, on struggling to get any points. We're almost, we are past five minutes in this war, and aggression is struggling pretty heavily, um, pretty heavily to try and take any point here. Um, not really what I was expecting. Um, not really what I was expecting. A ticking at 45%. I want to see them still, uh, you know, they're still trying. Oh, no. Highlight going for the highlight reel. Yak is in the mix. And Yak is getting taken out. Highlight takes him out. Oh, my God. And he's roasting marshmallows on Yak's dead body. Guys, you hate to see it. You hate to see it. Disgusting. He's going to be eating those. Not going to be tasty, but he's going to be eating them. C, taking at about 45, going on 50%. A has about 40% influence. So you can see attack trying to get some agency here on these side points but they still have a group on this b play to try and pressure it and it looks like c is taking out about 45 the b play is happening you can see yak charging in here and it looks like daddy sells is in the mix it looks like you have a bunch of players over here on this point um and it's look at all the influence right now b at about 10 or 15 percent influence c at about 45 but it's going back down in the favor of the defenders a is taking at about 25 percent influence but nothing is convincing right now take care doing a good job holding all three points it it looks like Manny. It looks like Daddy Sales going down over here. Uses TC player. He's the shot caller. He's coming back to B. The people that were just at A are going to answer B. And it looks like B has about 45% influence on it still. It's going on about 50. And the side points have been answered, guys. So side points completely answered. B taking out about 60%. And now look, the, the, the TC squad from the side points are going to be charging onto this B. And look at all these players. You see Ape going Ape, and he has to get out of there. Chunsi getting down. Actually, B taking in about 60, 65. And guys, we're going to have a big brawl here. It looks like Take Care swarming the war camp side. Take care of swarming the war camp side. They got to be careful though. A lot of them stacking up. Response coming up. It looks like B was going a little bit in the favor of the attackers. Attacker response coming up, and no, it looks like Take Care actually able to ward them off. And aggression having a hard showing. B, taking out about 65%, but it's not really going up any more than that. Response coming in. And now, look, you look at this. Response coming in hot. B, taking out at 70. This is looking pretty good. Sir Noob and Zreg in the mix back there. Sir Noob living up to his name, and he goes down. And you see Zreg goes down as well. Big clumps on the point. Looks like TC is focusing fourth side. Aggression. This is the move. This is the play. They have to take this point right here. They have a lot of good clump kills. They need to transition it to influence on the point. B, taking out about 66 or 60, 65%. It's going to fast. Mystery White getting taken down in the mix. And it looks like Yak goes down as well. Um, Minotazar is getting focused as well. But it looks like TC having a big force coming in from the respawns right now. So attackers actually got to be careful. I think the respawns are still too short to be pulling this off. But they're still trying. Aggression not giving up. Respawns coming in from the attackers. The attacking squad aggression going to be trying to take this B point. It is integral to try and take right now. We are almost 10 minutes into this war. And you got to get off. You got to get off this three point hold. Take care though. Able to hold it down graph coming out there on shui and it looks like shui goes down yak trying to help his boy but it's too little too late and it looks like guys take care having a strong showing of defense right now warrior in the mix it is just a good showing here from take care take care um you know they're ha they're obviously a super strong company and you can see right now they are just holding it down aggression struggling to even get a point right now 
They are struggling to even get a point. We have 10 seconds on this respawn. Like obviously, aggression, Marauder squad, Marauder company coming in strong. They took Evan Scale in glorious fashion in about 10 minutes. So they came in here, you know, feeling hot. They have a big war tomorrow on offense going up against Modern. So we're going to see how that play pays off. We're going to see how that goes. We have respawns coming up. Respawns coming up, guys. And you can see we're almost about 10 minutes in. 10 minutes in, guys. And it looks like aggression does not have any influence anywhere. B, uh, yeah, okay, I guess it has about 5 or 10, but man... Man, I don't know. Aggression still reinforcing this B play. It doesn't look like they're thinking anywhere else. Big clumps are going down over there, though. And it looks like they're still trying to get in on B. They got to grab the back line. That's a good clump there made by Yak. Where's the follow-up? Nobody following that up. Um, that's, You hate to see it. You hate to see it. That was actually a really good clump on a couple healers and some caster boys. B, at about 5 or 10% influence, Shui going to be hacking and slashing. But he goes down back there. And look, take care. Cleaning them up on the war camp side and they're going to try and kill them on the point. Look at this. Big clumps going down right here, and it looks like it's going in the favor of Take Care. A couple counter kills, though, coming in from Aggression, and it is not looking good here from Aggression. They are completely scattered all around this point. B has about 10% influence, but guys, guys, there's not much happening right now. Aggression is just having a good showing. Or my, my bad. Take care is having a good showing. Aggression is just, it's its looking rough. They are not able to get anything going down here. They're trying. They're trying to meet Take Care on a 50v50 Zerg. And sometimes whenever the enemy team is just, um, sometimes when the enemy team is, not, not to be rude, but a little bit better, um, you know, unfortunately, you're going to be losing that 50 v 50 Zergs. When you, whenever you try and do the full 50, um, you got to make sure you win the micro. And if you start losing the micro, then you're not going to win the 50. I know it sounds minor, but sometimes when you, or it sounds obvious, but when you focus the side points, you can actually cheese a point or two. And it's easier to do. So let's see. We have one second coming up on the respawns. Let's go. See, this is exactly what I'm talking about. C, taking out about 45%, going on 50. You need to spread take care thin. When you have three points up, utilize it. You need to spread them thin. You need to try and you, – you're never going to win the 50-50 if, if the enemy team is feeling like they're just winning the fights. So it looks like it looks like aggression trying to get C. C, taking it at 65%. This has to be a good play for them. Or maybe go for A. This wouldn't be a bad chance to go for A right now. Yes, this is actually what I like to see. The people that C might die, they need to survive. They shouldn't have died that quick. But A is actually the main call. A has about 10% influence on it, and that's exactly what you want. That's exactly what you want. So A has about 25%. So doing that, they made TC go all the way to C. So now the respawns have to meet them in the rotate and make sure that they don't get to A in time. And that's exactly what's, what's happening. Look at them fighting along the fort side here. They're trying to stop TC from getting to A and make B a priority. So A taking at about 45, going on 50%. And you guys see how this, and man, Yak getting caught in the mix. He's going to go down just like that. Response coming up in five. But see, just by doing that, you guys see how this made, this made it to where you have more um, agency. And again, sorry if you hear a kiddo in the back. That's a little arty boy. He's upset about something. W wife is taking care of that. Much love to her. A ticking at about 65, going on 70%. And this is exactly the play from whenever they decided to go on that uh whenever they whenever they tried to go for that C play. Now C is at about 50%. A is taking at 75, and they still want B to be a main target here. A and C are both at around the same influence, but it doesn't look like it's transitioning to much. C actually, though, is starting to go up for the attackers. C going on 75%. It's going on 80, and it looks like aggression might finally be taking a point here. C going up to 85, going on 90%. It's looking like... It looks like Aggression able to take a point off and of take care. You'd love to see it. Now, let's see what else they can do. A still has a good chunk of influence on it. Let's see if they can transition this momentum here. they got to start trying to pressure B, and that's exactly what's being called Manny. And then makes a big clump fight going down. And it looks like it's going a bit in the favor of the attackers over here on the sandbags. They've got a response coming in from take care. Going to be trying to answer them. And it looks like B starting to tick in the favor of the attackers. They had about 5 or 10% influence, but all that influence that A is going down. All the influence that a went down so now take care going to be coming in from that a rotate and they're going to try and answer it you see the drag over there hiking and slashing man we see a lot of these players fighting for this point but b is taking at about 25 percent it's going up 
B, going up in the favor of the aggress aggression squad here. A lot of people fighting on the side. You see Rexy, you see CJ trying to get out of the mix. And it looks like they're trying to get some kills. TC pushing that war camp side. Look at how many TC is on that war camp side. Big grab coming out right here. Is there any ice? Is there anything to follow up? Unfortunately, there wasn't. That was actually a really good grab, but not too much. They need to answer this TC squad on the fort side or along the war camp side. It's nuts. Look at how many bodies are over here. I need to see big grabs. I need ice showers. Let's get it going, guys. We need to get that. We need to get more stuff on this side. B, though, still ticking. It's going at about 25%. A, ticking as well. So now Take Care is going to have to answer a multi-split right now. A, going on about 40%. B, ticking at about 40%. Respawn's coming in five for the attackers, and they're not in too bad of a position here. So let's go, guys. Respawn's coming up in one second, and it looks like it looks like Aggression has some good agency on the points. I think the A side might be going down in the favor of Defenders, but we'll see. Yes. So it looks like Defenders able to get that A down, but right now is a good time for the attack to utilize this 50% influence they have on B with the respawns coming up. They have to look at B right now, answer the rotate, get these clump kills because they could take this. Respawns just coming in too from the defenders. So when you get kills right now, respawns are forever. That's a big clump. And it looks like Yak hitting the back line. Boris might be going down. No, he's out of there. He gets out. B taking out about 60, 65%. You can see Take Care knows they have to win this fight right here. Aggression also knows the same thing. It's going to be who wins these fights that determine this point. B taking out about 60% and it looks like it's still slowly going up in the favor of the attackers Yak hacking and slashing doing his thing but I don't know if it's enough respawns coming in from the fort now and you can see now get the kills you want to get the kills now when the respawns come up Manny is a casualty to this society right now and we have less than 15 minutes in the war guys we just passed the 15 minute mark the halfway mark in this war and it looks like TC is pushing aggression off the point into the war camp that's not what you want to see TC having a good hold along that war camp side creating pressure on the attackers to where they don't feel comfortable another big grab going down i'll tell you what yak is a big grab machine but it's unfortunate um it doesn't look like he's oh he barely survives he's going to be trying to get out of their path of destiny give him some health back and b starts going in the favor of the attackers yak is just hacking and slashing all over here b taking out about 50 percent they're not giving up aggression does not want to give up right now Aggression not giving up. B is that about 45 going on 50%. It looks like it's still going in the favor of the attackers. Big clump fights over here on this bonfire. Let's go, guys. It looks like aggression's focusing the fort side, but they got to be careful. TC loves to fight you in the war camp side. And look at that. TC wants to try and fight your healers, your casters that are over there sitting in the war camp side. And that's exactly what they're doing. So when aggression is pushing the fort, TC is pushing your war camp. So what that means is they're trying to kill your healers and you're trying to kill the respawns, which is fine, but your healers are dying and then people start dying on the fourth side and you're wondering where your healers are. But it looks like B is ticking in the attacker's favor. It's going on 60-65. It's looking pretty good for aggression. You can see them all hacking and slashing. Respawns coming in. This is actually momentum for aggression. Aggression going to be pushing heavy right now. They got to get some kills. B taking out 60-65%. Look at how many take care bodies over here in this A rotate. It's actually insane be going on 60% but it looks like it might be going down um it is slowly going down here respawns coming in from take care aggression has to get the clump kills get a grab down get some action going grab getting now only gets one b still ticking around that 60 65 70 it's going to 75 it's getting up there and aggression getting some agency here and it looks like we have big aoe's going down in the favor of aggression aggression pushing hard and b taking at 85 it looks like take care not going to try and stop them take care coming in here on the fourth they're trying to get there in time response just coming up but it's too little too late and b point goes down in the favor of aggression aggression able to take two points you love to see it having a good showing here let's see if they can take this next point any quicker let's see what happens guys we have less than 13 minutes in this war less than 13 minutes and let's see what aggression can do here let's go guys quick hydro homie you see tc player over here Getting a little bit of focus. Getting a little bit of focus here. Big clumps going in on the side of the aggression squad. They're trying to push and hack and slash their way in here. They're trying to take this point as quick as possible. They know how long a fort fight can last. Um, they want to make sure they have as much time to play in this fort as possible. And A starts taking already in the favor of aggression. A going on about 5 or 10% influence. And you can see a lot of TC trying to get into that back line. Get near the river. Try and get out of the uh, big clumps on the fort side. They're trying to get in the back. Point taking about 10 
under 15%. And these uh, Rondo points getting a lot of focus still. You can see Yak over here fighting along this river and ain't ticking at 25%. And now they're starting to look more towards the point. They're looking more towards the fort side. And that's the call. Aggression not giving up right now. But look at that. Big clumps coming in here from TC. They're going to be trying to take in. Respawns coming up in 20. TC coming in. Coming in strong. Able to get a couple kills. But we have respawns in 10 seconds. And it looks like a lot of aggression still having good agency over here. A lot of aggression still having agency. Respawns in 8 seconds. Let's go, guys. Can aggression do it? Respawns coming up in 1. Let's see, the point looks like it was past 50%. It is, and respawns coming up for the attackers. Defenders have to be careful here. Point taking at 60-65. The respawns are about a hit. So respawns hitting right now for the attackers is actually travesty um, for uh, for the defenders. Defenders got to be careful not to clump. Respawns coming in. Let's go. This can be it for aggression. Point taking at 60-65. A couple TC going down. It's going in. See the respawns coming in hot. And A is taking. A is taking at 60-65. Going on 70%. Hacking is Slash and Maelstrom's going down. Chunsty is in the mix. Got to get out of there. A taking at 70%. I don't know if TC is going to be able to have it in time. Point taking at 75 going on 80%. It looks like aggression might be taking it to a fort, guys. Aggression might be taking it to a fort. We're at about 85, 90%. TC making a last ditch play to get on the point, but it's too little, too late, guys. A taking about 90%. They're still trying. Aggression does not want them to have it. And you can see it is going to the fort, guys. And you guys know what we like to say here. We got a fort fight on fight night and that's what we'd like to see baby let's go we got a four fight we got 10 minutes on this floor aggression focusing up able to hone it up from the beginning and able to take it to a four let's make it happen guys let's see what they can do to tc here let's see what they can do to tc aggression coming in strong we got response coming in in 15 seconds let's see what happens let's see what happens let's see if aggression can take it Get the hype out in the chat, guys. We'd love to start our nights out like this. We got four wars tonight in A. We're starting this one out in a fourth fight. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Looks like Seagate going down. Seagate going down. Actually, this is actually A gate. Don't let the UI fool you. The A gate going down and the C gate going down as well. The back gates are going to be the target and the B gate still full. Still full, guys. This is intense. You know, 10 minutes is still a good amount of time on a fort. 10 minutes is actually what I call probably the best time to be getting onto a fort um, when it comes to being able to have um, enough time to still get some good regroups and get some uh, agency. So you can see Ice Wall and Traps back there. It's actually really smart from the defenders, but defenders getting pushed hard. It looks like the back gate's going down. They're trying to push in here. Side gates and back gates all down. B gate, the last gate standing. B gate, the last gate standing, guys. Let's go. Let's see if Take Care can have it. They got to be careful here. We know four fights are hard to uh, hard to do, but really it only takes about one or two clean wipes. Response in 45 seconds. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. Respawns in 40 seconds. This is a chunky respawn, guys. Chunky respawns. 30 seconds on it. Aggression having a fantastic showing right now. Having a good showing. I think if you're aggression, though, you want to maybe try and get some bodies trickling in or wait for the regroup. We have respawns in 20. This is a massive respawn right now. Let's go, guys. Going to be intense. I'm, I'm looking forward to see how aggression plays this fort. Um, last time we saw an Evan scale, they played it actually pretty uh, pretty perfectly. So I can imagine they, they might be able to take this from TC. TC having a bit of a shaky performance yesterday in that attack against Modern. So, you know, coming in here, I was interested to see how they do on defense. They were able to hold off a lot in the early game. Um, but, you know, struggling a little bit right now. They got taken to the fort, but 10 minutes is a good amount of time to be playing in a fort. Let's go. We have aggression pulling the trigger, trying to get into this action right now, trying to get into the fort. You can see we have seven minutes left in the game, guys. Only seven minutes. It looks like a big clump or big clumps over here on the bottom of the stairs. Grab gonna be coming out. This is big. Get some ice. Get some action on. Get some ice, please. Layer it, somebody. I didn't see an ice wall, man. It looks like Yak had a really good grab there, but not too much follow up. But it's still decent enough. He's surviving. He's creating pressure. Another grab going out, trying to follow it. It looks like Yak trying to get up there. He's, he's hiding in the pocket. He's Harry Potter. Hey, Hanging under the stairs. Point ticking very fast. Points going on about 25. Points going on about 25%. It's going on about 30. It's actually going up quick. Point is at about 40, 45%. Aggression might still be looking at the response. Look, Yak's getting ready. 
Respawn's coming up. Let's see if they can get the kills they need. This might be it. Aggression killing Vicky. Vicky goes down. It looks like Aggression's still going to be focusing the side, focusing the respawns. I don't know if that's going to be enough, though. I don't know if that's going to be enough. They're going to have to pull the trigger on the point. I believe they think that if they feel like they had enough on the respawns, I don't think they do. Look, Yak is still playing over here. So this means that the call right now is saying, hey, guys, we did not get enough kills. We did not get enough kills on the on the, on the the respawn. So we need to do it again. So you can see them. They're focusing. They're trying to do it again here. They're getting a couple clump kills. But looks like TC able to stabilize. And one of those back gates goes up. TC going to be able to take a breather. TC able to take a breather. Respawn's coming up in 10 seconds, guys. Let's go. Let's get it. Aggression having a fantastic showing. You know what, man? We love to see it from the Marauder squad, man. Love to see it. Marauder struggling on Pluto for so long. Bob the Builder is in this match. Can we fix it? Yes, we can. Three gates go up all almost at the same time. Insanity, both back gates and the A gate go up. So you can see this B gate and this side gate. It's the only place that Aggression can pressure through. But it looks like they're still having a good job trying to come in here. Aggression coming in, but they're getting hit with a little bit of ice, and that's the problem when the gates go up. See, this is exactly what I talk about, guys. When the gates go up and you funnel into the fort, you there's only two pressure points. So it makes it to where it makes it to where all they gotta do is put some ice and grass over there on the front of the gate, on the side or on the B gate, the B and the side gate, and you're screwed. So they need to take these gates down, and when you only have five minutes left. Whenever you only have five minutes left, it's hard. We have response coming up. Let's see what aggression can do. And it looks like they are focusing that C, that A gate. Both back gates are still up. We have less than five minutes, guys. Aggression having a fantastic showing here. But they got to. They got to put a little bit more in. They got to get some energy in here. Come on. Let's see if they can do it. Oops. Let's see if they can do it. Make my screen smaller. All right, dude. I'm going to make it a tad smaller for you guys. Oh, that's a little boy. Hey, Bubba. I gave you a hug. <laughs> gave me a hug. Oh, one second, guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Webcam frame. Hide that. I don't want to see that. All right, let's go, guys. Let's go. Four minutes, guys. Four minutes. Let's make it happen. Aggression. Having a good showing. Now, see, look, exactly what I talked about. They're answering the back gates. They're answering the back gates. They know they need to get these pressure points. They do not have time to play with. The regroup has happened, and they're pulling the trigger. They're going into the fort. They need to make sure they get some clump kills. Take care. Has to be careful not to get killed in these clumps right now. Aggression. They need this. Look at this huge clump. This is why we have a clump emo. My God, there's, there's massive bodies back here on this respawn, and it's massive, and Yak goes down 40 seconds on the respawn, though. You hate to see it going down right now. Take care. Able to focus up. Able to keep it going. 30 seconds and take care is able to hold it guys take care able to hold it can they do it though it looks like aggression needs to regroup and look aggression trying to get out of there they know they only have about one real chance to actually take one or two real chances at this point the respawns are at about 50 55 seconds so when you die right now you are waiting a whole minute and with two minutes left in this game you need to make sure that you do it right so we have respawns coming up Big grab going back on the back, though. It looks like somebody's fighting. they got to be careful not to die, though. Right now, if you're an attacker, do not die in the fort. Respawns just came up. You're going to be waiting for 55 seconds. Get the regroup. Three minutes left in this war. I think that's two or three respawns. Let's see what can happen. Aggression. Looks like they're calling for the regroup here. This has to be the hero play. they got to start getting some agency. Grabs going down. they got to win these teams fight. Their team fights right now. Pop the oak flesh. Both back gates still up, man. Bob the Builder just building those gates up this way. You hate to see Yak going in here with the grab. Needs some follow-up. Somebody get him a wall. Somebody get him in here. It looks like, though, they were going to answer in the back. TC able to answer him jumping down from the walls, actually. Stopping Aggression from coming in. But it looks like Aggression still flooding in. They didn't actually die in the wipes, so Aggression able, to, uh, Aggression able to come in here a little bit. And now you got a TC. Got to be careful. You're in the last two minutes. You have long respawn timers. The point starts ticking. The point's ticking at about 5 or 10%. I wonder with the respawns are yeah, getting called a little bit of the stairs. They're looking at the response. This is gonna be it, 
guys. Pre-icing it. Respawn's going to be coming up. Point taking about 45%. This has to be it. They have a squad on the point, and they got to get ready to answer this. Respawn's coming up. Let's see if aggression has enough. Big grab's going out. It looks like they got to be careful. TC might be getting wiped here. No, they're able to bounce out. Mystery White going down. But if you're aggression, you have to translate this to the point. You have to try and get to the point right now. It doesn't matter. You have to. You only have a minute and 30 seconds. You have to try and get to that point. I don't think it was enough, though. TC delayed the respawn, if you guys noticed that. They delayed the respawn. TC able to fight, though. But look at this. Some blue bodies coming in. They got to try and win it here. They do not have much time left. Do not have much time left, guys. We only have a minute left. The points start taking about 5 or 10% right now. And Aggression going to be trying to pull the trigger. They know that they can't wait too much longer. I don't think they got it. One more respawn. I don't think it's going to be enough. But the point's still ticking, though. They're not giving up. Aggression not giving up here. Yak hacking and slashing, doing his thing on the point. Getting some CC point ticking up at about 25. Going on 30%. Take care. He's going to have to answer the point here in a second. Point going on about 35. Going on 40%. It is getting dicey. 50 seconds on the respawn. And a side gate goes up in the last minute. You'd love to see it. It looks like they're going for one more. They're going for one more respawn kill. I don't know. They're stalling, and that's the thing. Everybody's pre-icing. Here we go, though. Respawn's coming up terrible. Going down. Moonfire might be going down here, and they do. Point has no influence. They gotta run to that point right now. They gotta get to the point. They gotta clear, and I don't think they're gonna have enough. Or maybe they do. They're getting there. The point's taking about five or ten percent. All of aggression is stacking. We only have the B gate up right now, and it looks like it's going in the favor of aggression. The point taking about forty-five, going on fifty percent. Aggression might be having it. They got. 20 seconds. Take care. Going to be hacking and slashing. Fighting hard on this point. B. Or the point is going on about 65. It's going up. But aggression has it. Let's see. 10 seconds left. Do they take it in time? I promise you there's not enough TC to stop them. It's all about the clock. And guys, 4 seconds left. Aggression shows the aggression. And they do it. They take care of take care. And they take care of business in this war, guys. Aggression coming in for the Marauders. Let's go. Get the GG's in the chat. GG's in the chat.